hello everyone welcome back welcome back so this is going to be for gemini's so gemini's i was going to do a 48 hours but i realized we did one like probably two days ago so we have to wait until at least three days okay so i feel like i'm going to do a single read for you today is friday so let's just do a single read okay and see what we have for gemini single Gemini single place now if this does resonate for you go ahead and thumbs up the video here on the YT um, go ahead and support each other in a comment you know section as well even if it doesn't resonate just be supportive to your brother and sisters in the comment section um, that is going through a lot right now and also we'll have the playlist linked below in the description box and if you guys are ready for your personal read you can go ahead and hit me up at the scene tarot at gmail.com the channel name at gmail.com we have three packages available look what, what's, what's going on with my hands three packages available the first one is three questions for 25 and then we have 55 dollars for 20 minutes and then we have 65 dollars for 30 minutes so if you're interested go ahead and shoot an email okay all right so let's see what we have for you Ooh, singles you have messages okay it's making sure that there's nothing here okay you know what I'm getting, you guys? I have the Nine of Vessels in reverse. I'm also getting the Nine of Cups in reverse. Like, similar energies, but a little bit different, you know? It's like you are definitely experiencing a setback when it comes to fulfillment in life. This is what I'm seeing. Like, everything that you have planned for some reason, it hasn't been working out. And I feel like there is a lot of empty, empty cups around you right now. This could be people, this could be promises, people coming into your life and promising you this or, or this or that or the other and this no fulfillment. This is what I'm seeing here. So we have the hangman. We, oh my gosh. I feel like you're trying to make a decision with this energy, you know less energy that you're trying to make a decision that is like you are ready for a new beginning but you're you just want to make sure that this is the right choice for you you know you want to make sure that everything is going to be coming together lovely like you want to make sure that things are going to be um meaningful like there is going to be meaning behind this it's a point behind all of this and it's like even though you're ready to jump off that cliff you're still looking behind you and just making sure that there is no surprises. There's no surprises. So you could be going back and forth or doing a lot of research with something that is important to you, you know? Um, I feel like there is a lot of new beginnings happening for you. A lot of things are coming to you because with this foolish energy, there is so many things that are going to be blissful for you, but you just want to make sure that this is the right Thing. So you probably are just really reading about things or, um, you know, trying to find out more information or get more information before you even sign up for a loan or before you even move to another apartment or an, into a house. And you're just trying to find out about all of that. Now, there is an energy here. There's this Pisces energy that is around you. This is what I'm seeing singles that are is very... Uh, it's, it's like a silent energy this person is watching you but at the same time they're not trying to come towards you they're not trying to have a new beginning in that way with you this is what i'm seeing i feel like this person is holding back this person is waiting for you to return waiting for you to take responsibility of this situation within this fools here in reverse okay and i'm seeing from the nine of vessels in reverse to the nine of cups in reverse like there is a huge form of just traumatic like it's like huge disappointment very hurtful as well but with the cups i feel like this is about definitely a relationship also with the vessels of nine of the nine of vessels is a relationship that you're experiencing it could be love it could be past relationships as well that is just the same kind of format the same kind of ending you know 
this is what I'm picking up here. Now, you have Scorpio energy within a death that is also showing up here. And I'm also seeing the severe broken heart here in the Three of Swords, okay? Like someone have three swords within your chest and you're just standing there and you're trying to heal from this but and trying to move on from this with the energy of the death, okay? Like you understand the process of all this, you understand why this happened, but at the same time, you're not trying to hold on to this broken heart. Um, why am I getting like this wasn't, like you just knew that this person was going to disappoint you anyway. It's like you, you weren't shook by this, but you're still, it still hurts. This is what I'm seeing here. Okay, so you have the nine of cups. Let's see what else. Ooh. You have a lot of vessels coming out. So it's a lot of pain here when it comes to a relationship. Singles. And this could be an ex that you've been dealing with. We have Scorpio. We have Pisces energy. Um... Five of Cups, too. Like, you just feel like you're quite alone and like you're abandoned. Like, you just, oh, like something like this relationship is spoiled. Like, I'm getting like spoiled milk. That's what I'm hearing. Like, like you're just, the taste of it, it doesn't taste right anymore. It doesn't taste good anymore. It doesn't feel good anymore. This relationship, this connection that you're, 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 you're trying to, figure out what to do and i feel like a lot of you are in this process of just leaving and moving on here with the five of cups just moving on or trying to at least we have the king of pentacles the page of vessels the five of vessels in reverse another form of like wow wow heartache five of vessels Look at how the body is just destroyed. Like this person destroyed you. Cut you up. It's like horrible. Be careful with this, you guys. I'm seeing like some kind of physical agony too. So you guys could be in a physical, you know, situation where someone is really putting their hands on you and physically trying to destroy you or put, you know, a lot of bruise, a, a bruises on you or um, you just feel quite quite alone you feel like this person is going to harm you and if you feel like that this is a time for those of you to take this seriously and really confined into someone and get help i'm seeing like this person is dramatic so they come off like one moment they're just like not interested in you and then suddenly they're there and giving you this dramatic Apology, maybe with tears and water coming out of their eyes and snot coming out of their nose. And they're just like, you're just like, wow, I'm so sorry this happened to you. It's like they put you in a place of, and talk about manipulation, because that's a huge form of manipulation. And then they turn around and then they're like this energy of, you know, don't care about you anymore kind of vibe. And the things that they do... It's like, this couldn't be the same person that was crying like two days ago, you know? But I'm seeing like you're ready to move forward when it comes to relationships. You're ready to move on. Um, you want something more, but something is holding you back here. This is what I'm feeling here. Then you have the Ten of Vessels in reverse. So a lot of you are coming out of this traumatic experience. Traumatic experience when it comes to love. And it's like there's no fulfillment there, but you learned a lot. That's what I'm picking up as well. You learned a lot um, within this person um, being in your life. But at the same time, it's like your 11-11 is so off within these two nines. Nice. And it's like, oof. I feel like a lot of you have this like, 
past issue that's going on some kind of past issue that i'm seeing like is coming back up to the surface this relationship that i'm picking up is someone from your past on the back of the deck is the queen of cups here it could be a motherly figure or a feminine energy that you're dealing with that doesn't know how to say i love you don't know how to express their feelings towards you um, very cold, very manipulative, you know, very sensitive. They put a lot of things on you. Um, singles, this is what I'm seeing. <clears throat> it's like you're definitely ready for more. You're ready for more. You're dealing with a child. This person is acting like a child. Like this person act like they know everything. They shut you down. Queen of the Page of Swords. They don't know how to communicate, especially when it comes to serious things, you know, that you want to talk about. This is what I'm, I'm getting here. You have the 1111 in reverse between you and this energy. And I'm also seeing a lot of 1111s here that is in reverse for me, the 10 of... Um, vessels is one of them the nine of uh, vessels as well we also have the 11 11 that is completely like in reverse here it's like this energy you just don't feel like it is good a lot of you are scared why am i getting this fear of moving forward like this is all that you know it's like i'm getting like one of those energies like you know your family is toxic but this is the only family you have kind of vibe so you just stay with it even though they hold you back from your success, you still stay with it. I'm seeing like this accomplishment that you're going to receive. This isn't all all not bad singles. I'm seeing like this accomplishment, but at the same time, you're working really hard to keep it. You know, this is what I'm seeing here. And as you're going through this accomplishment, I'm also seeing like this foundation of this energy coming towards you, and it's not a good energy coming towards you just to live off of your compliment accomplishments so you need to be very careful about this energy i'm seeing a lot of you protecting your mental state so this is a lot for you i'm seeing like you're walking back like you're leaving this connection then you're walking back so it's a lot of like back and forth here like you're not sure if this is something for you like are you doing the right thing within the eight of cups here you're just like having these huge regrets i don't know what this is hmm queen of pentacles like you're protecting yourself but you're having huge regrets here i feel like it's about money as well i'm seeing a, a similar energy to you masculine or feminine energy doesn't even matter because they're both here nine of pentacles the Ten of Swords, and then we have the King of Cups. Wow, what a wonderful outcome. It's crazy how you're going through so much, but it's going to pay off in the very end. You're going to be very stable and very secure within this Nine of Pentacles, beautiful energy symbols. And then I'm seeing this Ten of Swords where you're closing a lot of these chapters within your life. This is also the energy that I'm picking up. You know, this negative energy, this negative person that keeps following you around. And I feel like it could be um, a masculine energy. But this person is coming to use you or trying to use you. Could be a fatherly figure or have masculine energy with a, a female. So it could be a motherly figure as well. But I'm seeing love coming into your life. So a lot of you are closing doors. You're picking up your money. You're working really hard. You're just making sure that whatever move you're going to make within the foolish um, energy, the foolless, I should say, energy, um, you're just making the right step. You're not jumping off this cliff without, without you know, it's like you are standing on this cliff. This is what I'm seeing, but you're looking behind you, making sure and then of course the dog is trying to protect you but i feel like you're looking 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 paying attention you know what's behind you or what's coming it's like you're not taking these risks you know what i mean like you're not taking risks that you don't know about 
and you're leading yourself into this fulfilling it doesn't have to be love but it's a definitely a cup where i'm just seeing this huge form of you know accomplishment the king of cups your cup is basically going to be overflowing you know it's not the ace of cups but it's still a, an amazing offer from where you're coming from so there's a good things ahead for you you're closing a lot of this toxic environment out singles you're going through a lot you're going through this severe awakening with this broken heart this acknowledgement but again even though you're going through this severe broken heart i don't feel like it's something that you never knew that wasn't going to come towards you i feel like you're just disappointed within this person and you were trying to give them the benefit of a doubt that they were going to do something you know to make you happy or to just change your mind about them at least at this point in the relationship so let's see what angels you have around you because I feel like there's a lot of angels around you because you're coming out at the end with light you know this is what I'm picking up okay okay you guys so yeah like I figured you have your ancestors watching over you your angel your guide is also with you in time of need you're thinking about all of this you're thinking about this um energy that is watching over you you're remembering all a lot of good times um that you have experienced with this energy i'm also seeing that prepare yourself because you're going to go through the challenges within your life you're going to go through it you know but you're going to be fine you're going to be guided you're going to be going through this tunnel and then you're going to be going out to the light okay look at that past issues confirmation what i was picking up the angel of past issue number 23 so this is a family matter for those of you a family matters i'm seeing pictures here i'm seeing memories here for some of you this could be an ex that you were like trying to get away from and they're trying to come back in this person kind of used you as well wow you have your angel of comfort angel michael just comforting you, holding you tight, making sure that you know that there, this angel is there for you. Um, stability, you know, it's like whatever you're going through, you're just going to have this force of stability all the time. I'm um, seeing it's time for business. It's time for balance. It's time for you to get back out there. Um, I'm seeing like whatever has been missing or this person have took from you, you're going to get it back with your angel of balance is coming back in your path or is already there within your path. So this is what I have for you, Geminis. I hope that this resonates singles. And if it does, you know what to do. Like this video. Give this video a huge support on the channel. Thank you guys for joining me today and always being by my side. You guys are truly, truly amazing. And yeah, be kind to everyone in the comment section. Love each other. You know, know that you are one within this universe um we're all here to deliver a message we're all here to learn we are all here to help the universe evolve right so love you guys and i will see you guys in your next read bye guys